avocado toast? Yes. Okay, so let's start by cooking the bacon. Have you ever heard of avocado toast before? No, I have never heard and I have never had avocado toast. Okay, well avocado toast is the reason that millennials are still broke living at home with their mom and dad because they like to go buy avocado toast and Starbucks coffee where the avocado toast is 10 bucks and the Starbucks coffee is 8 bucks. We're going to figure out how to make avocado toast at home. So this is some sort of uncured bacon, so it's probably going to be more like Canadian bacon than it is going to be American or Southern bacon. works. Bacon, the gift from God. It smells really good. See, we could use oil to brown the toast when we toast it. I'm going to reuse the bacon grease. So it tastes like bacon. Do you want me to do this? I can do it. You're holding the camera. So, how many avocado toasts are we going to make? Okay, well, we're going to make one with tomato, right? One with bacon. One with just straight up avocado. So we're going to make three different kinds. Limes to squeeze onto the toast. Okay. The knife's getting a little dull. You need a Ginsu knife. What is that? It's a knife that'll cut an aluminum can or a tomato. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to season the tomatoes a little bit. And yes, Mom, I am getting ready to eat tomatoes. I know she's watching. Just a little bit of salt and pepper on the tomatoes. I guess people can season their tomatoes however they want. Do you know what avocado hand is? No, what is it? Avocado hand apparently is what some doctors have been referring to those people that cut their hands while they have been cutting open avocados. Oh. That's what the people do here. Hold up, look. What they'll do is they'll cut the avocado open oh, with the knife, right? Oh, don't cut that way. And then when they get done, they'll hold the avocado like this, then they'll take the knife, and they'll try to get the oh. pit of the avocado out, and they'll go, thunk, thunk. Don't, don't, don't do this. The knife's upside down, sweetie. This oh, is the dull side. Okay. And they'll go, thunk, and try to get the avocado pit out, and then they'll slice, and they'll miss, and they'll slice their hand. Yes. Okay, I cut it all the way around. Now I know some people cut fancy and cut around and get everything. I'm just gonna try to dig it out because we're just gonna squish it up into squishy stuff anyway, right? Mm -hmm. Lemon juice? The lime. Fruit smoothie with the leftovers. Bacon? Bacon in the. It looks cute with bacon on it, but I don't know how it tastes. Well, there's going to be bacon on the, on the avocado toast, so I tell you what, take a drink and tell me what you think. Yeah, try a little bit of bacon. It is still like bacon. But you got the, the, the sweet orange juicy taste. How does it go? Does it go together good? good? You got the salty and the sweet? Oh, do you have a zester? What is that? A thing that, uh, to scrape. Oh, 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 yes. So the toast is brown. Put some avocado on it. Wow, that's a lot of avocado. Yes, it is. A couple of tomatoes on it. Now we can put a little red pepper flakes, Parmesan cheese on it. Okay. Oh, oh is it a, looks good. It's a 
lot of avocado. That might be too much. So this one is going to be a plain avocado toast. I'm going to put some red pepper flakes on it. Parmesan cheese on top. No tomato. Okay. Regular. Next one is going to be bacon. Bacon avocado toast. And on top of this one, pepper flakes, Parmesan cheese. That is a bacon avocado toast. So this one is red pepper flakes. We're going to put Parmesan cheese. And we will put this in the stove. Oh, we're not going to cook. And then we're going to put a tomato on top. This one is going to get bacon as well. Okay, everybody out there that likes their BLTs, there it's bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwiches. Give me a thumbs up. This is going to be sort of like a BLT, but with avocado toast. Bacon and tomato avocado toast. We should eat it together. Okay. I'm interested to see how the sriracha sauce is going to taste on it. I bet you it's going to taste good. We can do this way. Okay, so which one are we trying first? I want to try this one. This one is plain avocado. Okay. With just the avocado. Thank you. I'm ready. Are we gonna race? One. No, 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 no. Two. You always eat faster than me. Okay, ready? It's good. That's very good. I need spicy. That is incredibly good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually, this would make a wonderful appetizer, wouldn't it? Mm. I think for an appetizer, we probably got too much avocado on it, but I'm gonna tell you something. Mm. I'm, I surprised myself. I wasn't sure how this was gonna turn out. It turned out pretty good. So did you know about avocado toast this morning? Yeah. And what did you think when I kept saying that I wanted avocado toast? I saw that you would just cut avocado and put it on the top. <laughs> so what do you think about the drink that has bacon in it? The flavor is not mixing together. So do you want to show them up close? Let's try. We're eating a lot of avocado. Which one's next? The bacon. I will give you the big ones. Now, if you were out in Silicon Valley, every morning before you go to work, stop off and grab yourself an avocado toast. I think I will put the tomato on the top of it. Yes. I think it tastes better with the sauce. Do you like the first one more or the second one? It's hard to say. They're both really good. You like toast. Well, the toast has a good texture because it's a little bit rough on your tongue, but on the top you've got the avocado, which is squishy, and then it's a little bit spicy. It's got good, good texture. Crunchy, squishy. Next. <laughs> Next. Which one do you want to try? I'm trying this one. Thank you. You know what? This is going to wind up being a whole meal, isn't it? Yes, I think I'm getting a little bit full. Yeah, I'm actually full too. So we already ate the one that had tomato and bacon on it, didn't we? This one's just tomatoes. <laughs> They're all very good, aren't they? Yes, yes. But I will tell you this, I think the sriracha, sriracha sauce mm. really makes a big difference. I like the sriracha sauce. Okay, so okay what's the next, next one? Next, the next. Now you're made I'm getting full. The next one is the bacon. I will give you the. This one has more bacon. So, what do you think? The sauce. Tomato on it. We didn't eat the fruit. The fruit just for decoration? Yeah. <laughs> it's American food? I'm not really sure, but it's, it's something. You eat so fast. Do you it's want good. more? I mean, that, that's enough to fill you up. I mean, I've essentially had 
We made four toasts. We cut them in half. So I had two toasts and you had two toasts. Yes. Before I had several slices of bread. <laughs> so I'm full. Well, it's almost done except for the cleaning. I'll clean it. I'm full. Do we want to cook anything else? Fish shaped rice cake. I can't eat. I'm full. I'm full. We ate a bag of bacon. I put the extra in the refrigerator. So. Oh, see, I have one more bacon. I will eat it. This will be my dessert for tonight. I will drink it all before I go to bed. Even the orange peel tastes good. The orange <sighs> zest. Okay, so that's all. That's all for today. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yes, sweetie, I made you more. I liked it so much last night that I made us this for breakfast this morning also. Oh, I like it too. This one I put an, I put an egg on it though. So you, it's oh, breakfast because it's got an egg. Yes. It looks super good. I can't wait to eat it. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about it too.